hello guys welcome back to my channel my name is Tolu Nazel if you see me for the first time you're welcome and if you're my returning subscriber thank you for coming again today I'll be taking you into Ikoyi and I'm taking you to Banana Island guys this video is gonna be interesting so please sit relax and enjoy this video and while that's it if you enjoyed the video if you like it and you like what you see please don't forget to hit the like button for me and also subscribe and guys please watch this video to the end and enjoy it Ikoyi is one of the most expensive neighborhoods in nigeria and it is home to the most luxurious place on the island of lagos state which is banana island banana island is under the etiosa local government area we are turning into banana island road There are lots of apartments here. Riverside Apartment 27 Banana Island Road. Victoria Waterfront Four short townhouses This is already looking good I'm going to take you around briefly to see what Banana Island is like So please watch this video to the end because I'll be sharing with you what I noticed about this vicinity and while at it, if you enjoy or you like anything about this video, please make sure you express it in the comment section down below. And also, while at it, hit the like button for me. So guys, watch and enjoy this video. We are in Banana Island. This place is majorly residential. Although you have the Airtel office here, the road is interlocked. A lot of influential billionaires in the society live here. The likes of Mike Adenuga, Ali Kodangote, David O, Linda Ekeji, and many more. Banana Island is not full yet. A lot of construction work is going on here. The environment is so serene and it's very green and clean. This is Second Avenue. This place is very quiet and it is such a private estate. Security in Banana Island is very tight. Before you can be given access, you need to have the code which is generated and changed early. Guys, please stick with me. I'm still taking you into the street.
this looks like a very good environment to raise a family because it feels kind of safe Just like most places in Lagos, individual properties are fenced. This place is clean and shiny. All the houses are well painted. The curbs and the landscaping is beautiful. Look at the beautiful mansions. Look at this place. Guys, this place is beautiful. What do you think? Put it down in the comment section so I'll know what you think about it too. This is Mike Adenuga Avenue. This is land, probably somebody's property. Look at this white house. It's drizzling. Please, if you see drops of rain on the screen, please bear with me. I hope I'll be able to show you a significant part of this place before the rain starts. So guys, please keep watching and enjoy this video. I noticed most of the turns of this avenue are closes, but I'll find another avenue and show you. Third Avenue. The road network is very good and it's so wide. Three one four close. It's a beautiful, quiet place, guys. Lagoon View Villa. This place is really big. It's so big. And to think that it's not yet full, that you still have parcels of land everywhere. Wow. I noticed there are lots of empty apartments and houses here and there are many houses for rent a five bedroom detached duplex sells for about 1.6 billion and that's over 1.8 million dollars hey guys support my channel by subscribing it's absolutely free just hit the red subscribe button and if you enjoyed this video or you like anything about it don't forget to hit the like button for me leave me your comments i love seeing what you guys think and please help me share this video on those street
D close. So you have property to let here. Guys, please share with me your thoughts on Banana Island in the comment section and let me know can you live in Banana Island? guys please stick with me i'm still going to show you the immediate environment outside banana island so stay tuned for that We are on 5th Avenue. Brona Street to my right. Nasarawa Street to my left. Abia Street to my right. This is Abia Street. So this is your immediate environment when you're out of Banana Island. There are lots of nice apartments here. I noticed something in the area. There's a lot of stagnant water here. It's either the drainage is bad or it's a waterlogged area or this place just experiences a lot of flood. So guys, please put in the comment section if you know anything about this place. If there's any issue with flood, please put it in the comment section so we'll know. Guys, hope you enjoyed watching this video because I enjoyed bringing it to you. Thank you for watching and see you in my next one.
Thank <laughs> you.